New at 6, the man charged in the shooting of an Amtrak conductor near Chicago is from Wes Allis. That conductor remains in intensive care on a ventilator tonight. The shocking crime leaving the community where the suspect lived in disbelief. Prosecutors say 79-year-old Edward Klein boarded an Amtrak train on Monday bound for Las Vegas because he wasn't happy at VMP Manor Park. It's an independent living community in West Dallas. We were surprised as anybody. You know, you see the news and, you, you, you know, we didn't really know uh, what had, had happened. And then when we found out that he was a resident here, uh, you know, we obviously felt awful. Sean Callahan said Klein hadn't lived at the facility for very long, so he knew very little about him. Also adding he couldn't say much because of privacy laws. Now, according to prosecutors, Klein got to Missouri before changing his mind and boarding an eastbound train headed back home. In Naperville, Illinois, Klein tried to deboard, but an Amtrak staff prevented him from doing so because it wasn't the right stop. He became irate, pulled out a handgun, leaned out the window, and shot conductor Michael Case, who was standing on the platform. Honestly, it was pure shock. Jenna Gibson works with Case's wife. He's the kind of guy that if I got backed into a corner, I would want him on my side. Case is a Navy veteran and a father of four. His wife says he underwent a lengthy surgery and is now on a breathing tube. Klein, a retired Federal Protective Service officer, is charged with attempted murder and aggravated battery with the discharge of a firearm. He's being held on $1.5 million bail.